ng pag-children, today ang pag-uusapan natin yung vitamin C and common cold, no? Kasi uso na naman ngayon ang sipon. Kasi tag-ulan na. So, palaging sinasabi, oh, mag-vitamin C ka, mag-vitamin C ka para hindi ka magkasipon. Pero saan ka nang galing at saka ano bang ebidensya talaga para sa vitamin C preventing and treating common cold? So, Did you know that there are over 200 viruses? Usually, the common cold, talaga, it's caused by a virus. So, hindi sa bacterial kay ni mo kailangan mag antibiotic. Several different viruses can have an effect, the same effect. Yes. So there are about 200 viruses that can cause the common cold. Pero iba iba lang yung iba iba lang sila. You can it can present from congestion, sneezing, sore throat. Pwede kang magkaroon cough, sometimes headache, fever, and red eyes. Or sometimes cold lang. Yes, yeah. sometimes cold lang. So because it's one of the more common respiratory viruses, palaging ang, ang, ang palagi tanong saan, pwede ba ako mag-antibiotic? Actually, hindi eh, kasi virus siya. So antibiotics will not work. So sabihin, mag-vitamin C ka, drink a lot of water, mm -hmm. diba? So ever since... The, it was isolated well, nag-umpisa kasi yung ano na yan, yung ating pagbigay ng vitamin C noong 1970s it was actually a Nobel laureate Linus Pauling he, he did a study on vitamin C and treating a common cold and from there he, he concluded that it can help and from that time on sinasabi na vitamin C can help with a common cold. So the Cochrane group, what they did, they studied all the studies studying vitamin C and common cold. And what they saw that um, it seems like it is true that it can reduce the incidence of colds, but in the general, it was not tested in children or no? general population yung ginawa. So it seemed like their conclusions were Vitamin C supplementation failed to reduce the incidence of cold in the general population. However, it is very useful in patients who have been exposed to periods of severe or reg severe exercise. So because of that, because with the regular the exercise, severe exercise, umaba by immune system mo. When you give vitamin C, it boosts your immune system. So it's system. not necessarily a treatment for cold, Maybe but a treatment uh, more on prevention. Because doc, no, if uh, correct me if I'm wrong, uh, initially vitamin C was made for mga sailors to treat scurvy. Yes. That's why it was called ascorbic acid. Yes. Because of the scurvy, de ba? Valedictorian natin today yan. So, ito. So, their conclusion was, mabasahin ko kasi very important, regular supplementation trials have shown that vitamin C reduces the duration of the colds. But this was not replicated in some of the studies. So, pwedeng Pwedeng pagka mababa immune system mo, you boost it up with vitamin C, but it is not a treatment. When you have colds, you take your vitamin C, it can reduce the duration of your symptoms. But again, it is not a treatment. However, um, because it is quite consistent no, that the vitamin C reduces the duration and the severity of colds, and the low cost and the safety, it is worthwhile for us to take it. So that's the most important thing. So when they looked at all the studies, it does not treat colds, but it reduces the duration of your symptoms. It can boost their immune system, kaya, kaya nga nag-reduce yung duration ng symptoms mo. Uh, but it is not a cure for a cold. So with, however, because it's low cost, saka very safe siya, mm -hmm. natin. Yun yun. So, Ay, ngayon, alam mo, ito kung uh, needed, uh, recommended for ano, daily okay, intake ng vitamin C, yeah, yung dose. Yung sinasabi kasi nila ng, ano, meron kasing, when you say regular ingestion of vitamin C, ang sinasabi, 0.2 grams a day. 0.2 grams a day. So, 0.2 grams. Kasi dapat ako ngayon dalawa yung... Is that 2,000 milligrams? 0.2 grams, 200. Ano, no, 200 milligrams a day. 200 milligrams. Diba dalawa yung sinasabi nila ngayon na vitamin C, isa yung ascorbic, isa yung sodium ascorbate. Parehas ba yun sila? Na yung dose na sinasabi mo? Hindi. 
I don't think so. Kasi That one I don't. Alam ko yung ascorbic kasi hindi lahat na absorb eh. Yes. Because ano, di ba may acid may factor acid yan. May acid daw. Yung sodium, uh, sodium salt. Mas okay, mas marami. Oh, kasi sodium is salt, di ba Doc? Yeah. So sodium salt ascorbate. helps you retain. Mas okay yan yung sodium oh. ascorbate. Oo, oh, oh, like uh, may madaming brands out there na alam natin na sodium ascorbate. Ako usually I just give the ascorbic acid. Ah. Kasi ako, pag may sipon Doc or if I'm sodium. sick, 5,000 milligrams iniinom ko. Ito nga, meron sila 8 grams Mm. Meron isang large trial na ginamit na 8 grams as therapeutic dose at the onset of symptoms and two, two ther therapeutic trials used 5 day supplementation reported the benefit so 8 grams a day yun yung mega dose mm. 8 grams 8000 mg What's the difference sa capsule yung nasa vial ano po ang mas okay ah. Pag capsule kasi um, you ingest it and then once it is in your ab in your stomach tapos it goes to your intestines that's absorbed by your your blood vessels maraming pinanggagalingan so pero kung vial Inject. IV yan direct to the bloodstream so yung absorption mo is higher oh. faster faster oh. yan so mega doses of vitamin C can help boost our immune system but it will not treat your common cold. It will not make it disappear. Yeah. It will not make it disappear, <laughs> it will but it will make the duration shorter. shorter. So, yeah. so the general rule is you take a lot of vitamin C kahit wala kang cold. To help, para, uh, to help prevent. Lalo sure. na when, during ano, moments of stress. Because mm. it just yung, helps your body fight off whatever sickness. Go out. So, okay. okay pa din siya. Mm -hmm. right. So mag-vitamin C tayo. Maghanap tayo sponsor ng vitamin C. Dati meron tayo sponsor.